So hey guys welcome back to Marvel DC Talks and Jetpot Toys review So today I am going to review and unbox this Spider-Man action figure from Homecoming As you guys can see it's my birthday gift Today I am going to review this so Stay tuned in this video like and support so Let's get started So guys again welcome back to Marvel DC Talks and Jetpot Toys review So guys as you guys can see today we have our Spider-Man action figure That is our gun shooter Spider-Man and guys basically I don't like to collect this type of electronic figures but guys I got it in my birthday gift many times ago in 11 January so it's quite good now and I will show you this review also now so first we will see guys the box please guys subscribe our channel and like this video if you guys will like it so it's our box packaging just look at this here you can see our spider-man tom holland photograph i think from civil war like this wide eyes very cool character and here's spider-man homecoming post spider-man homecoming superhero battery operated simple bootleg toy it is it's already unboxed i kept it for showing you guys that was a spider-man so that was our bracket box and now we'll go to our figure toy so guys as you guys can see it is my spider-man figure <coughs> we'll show you the overall cinematics of this figure also just look at this so it has no power of standing it can only lie here overall you can see guys the detailing and the articulation the good thing that i saw in this figure i will show you i will show you now so first guys if i talk about it the here you can see the spider logo i think it's toby Maguire spider-man from spider-man 3 i think it's not from spider-man homecoming because the design is like that movie just look at this face club face club is really awesome guys in this price range I have an, another Tobey Maguire but this figure is literally very nice as you guys can see here the face here you can see the eyes also and the overall the texture the web painted that's a very good thing and here you can see guys the arms web pattern here also spider logo here also spider logo just look at this the bad thing only in this figure that this arms is skinny that's not a good thing that's a poor thing other than that you can guys look at these figures under the features in the gun the, the machine gun of PUBG just look at this we can also remove it also a little bit and as you guys can see it's seriously guys you can see the all well, the magazine the overall AK-47 it's a very great gun with very much detailing but obviously spider-man don't use guns as these are knockoff figures and here we can see little color has worn out here and here you can see guys the electronic feature and here we got very much rubberized material sorry guys and here you can see a knife also spider-man doesn't use this but you can see guys the overall these soft pads these are bendable i am showing you guys just look at this and you can see the blue color hair very much glossy here you can also see the cuff just look at this here also here a battery operated here means a battery the switch i will also show you the overall features in overall view red and blue color combination in the leg simple type if they put some color in here and here as we have seen in Toby Maguire's suit then it could be more good it can be better so if I talk about the articulation then I think guys it's very much great articulation if I compare it it's going very good and first you can see torso up crunch up down up down uh, because of the these inner parts here we got sewer also side by side 
and in the arms i will show you this is soft full rubber material guys full rubber material it is very good figure it is and here also arms as you guys can see here we got wrist articulation you can rotate its wrist like this just look at this you can also rotate the wrists also just look at this here also it's rotatable up for downward also we got a moment that's a very that's a very cool thing guys about this figure and here we also got peg holes so here we can also attach it but it will not good i think and guys here you can see a peg hole here so we can click it so that was figure and no head articulation like this like this and the wrist articulation that's a quite good thing and here we got some more bendable features also bendable legs little bit awkward joints are here as you guys can see very different than the other articulation we got in boot leg figures and here we got a boot cut that a very much little bit that's a very cool just for the articulation you will see the function here i'm on it you will see so guys thank you for watching our video hope you have liked our review of a spider-man toby maguire spider-man figure that is gun shooter spider-man hope you have liked this video and please support us and thanks for 300 subscribers help us reach more subscribers please guys support us and power rangers video are also coming soon please keep supporting liking and comment please your support subscribe my channel and if you guys want gaming content you can also subscribe gaming star silent still that's my second account so please support me please i'll meet in the next video till then Bye-bye.